Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm back after a long pause and I'm going to show you something really, 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 really cool and that is regarding an IP cam. And this IP cam is a wired IP cam. It's connected through a micro V, micro A, sorry. Oh, sorry, A, <laughs> USB A to USB uh, micro. So now I want this to extend it. It's just one meter, but I want it to be like this. Uh, I want it to be around five meters, five and a half meters, something that sort. So what I'm thinking is that I'll cut this off like Ethernet. Cut it off. Put this aside. This cable. Cut it. What do you want? Cut it. I this wood. This is cut it in from the center. Two halves. And. I will just what I do, I will just slice it. There should be some kind of insulation. There is insulation. Come on. You see these two colors. So what you need to do is connect the two colors for this. And it's in the same color, if it is orange, like for example, this orange and what blue, the other end of this Ethernet cable should be orange and blue. And yeah, let's check it out. Let's see if it actually works or not. Like insulation has come out. The ins okay, it's gonna work. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. Hopefully, it's going to work. Come on, guys, we all can do it. It's simple. Ethernet cable, simple. Take it, go around. It's already cut. Just cut it. You know the insulation. You can see this colors. What I'm going to do now is I will going to cut this main strand out and throw it aside because it doesn't matter. Now these key colors, you can choose any colors because we just need to match the other end. So what I'm thinking, I don't miss, I like blue. So what I'm going to do is going to keep these other colors aside for now and only use this so there's a trick use if you want to unshield on uh, two others just take this and just done it's that simple stain the cables all good perfect and slice it using your nails if you have nails or just use a cutter i'm using this because i'm just i'm used to using the splicer and see it's coming off from here and done so this is one here this is another one what i'm going to do is just cut this end off because it's not required so you see these two sides are exposed already. Now what we need to do is just connect these two ends. Like now what is green, one is white. 
so uh, gray color i'm going to con- connect it to to blue okay so gray color we're gonna need what do you call solid it together So this one is one pair. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to solder solder this pair. Now when I say solder this pair, I'm actually going to solder it. At the same time, let me just connect this pair two at the same time. What's the loss? Two pairs, two connectors at the same time. You know, it's that simple. It's almost simple. It's okay. The slightest kind of a fix is not a issue, but you should not always do this because it's not a correct way. Now, if you can see, I have a soldering iron and I have the wire. Yep. But what I want to do is I'm just going to. like that simple it's like actually really really simple and like it should actually you know not be an issue so you can see it's already in set so it's a bit soldered so I'm very happy just make it a little more happier okay this is perfect so one side is done so you can see it's properly done there's no issues it's sweet you know it's actually cool next is what mm. i don't know where's my tape so that what do you put that tape nevertheless let's leave this aside let it cool down you know that's all okay still here's the other end This is the other side. I'm going to take this, hold this thing, remove it all, isolation. All these colors are here. These colors, just leave it aside. I can just use the grip only, but it should not affect anything. But all the people don't cut any all one of these. But if you actually going to use it, you know. So I just take it and I just want to you know fold this aside and I, as you know the tip of how do you unscrew this thing. I'm gonna get a good comments today because you all know why. <laughs> so uh, take oops see easy. I'll just be careful. See, it got cut off. So you have to be careful when you grab. Balance it first together. Take and take and take and take this. 
take this and so it's better use <laughs> look at this excess and this is power going to go through this so a, a simple fix really simple fix i can take this cable and i can just straight it out it will tear this jacket or cut it off so you get like a christmas tree over here if you want take this hold it cable around done simple yep and yeah seriously this is why you require a uh, slicer for this thing obviously because I can't find it I have two or three of this but I can't find where it is so I'm like let it be whatever let me try my way because you don't, you will not always carry or you might always forget it and you might be having a crimper with you so a crimper can be your sati you know so yeah sati <clears throat> very bad joke the crimper can be your friend what I'm trying to say so you can see this one So produce the nails. <laughs> I would rather think that work out. Next is the other cable. Where is the other side? The other end is over here. You can see. Again, what the same thing. Now I'm very confused actually. How do I even unshield this thing? Clear it out, my nails. Full isolation, isolation again. What insulation again? On isolation, it seems. I must say, I like this insulation style. Insulation, isolation, some innovations. It helps me create observations. Okay, now I'm it's horrible. So you can see excess. Non excess. You can use the nails. It's an optional, you know, thing. What did I just start? Gray is for this color. Gray is for blue. Right? Comment below if I'm right or wrong. That's simple, like. This is my first time trying it out, so <laughs> don't mind if, if it doesn't work out. But like, if you see practically, it should work because I don't see any flaws. But if this is just going to send only power and not data, then yeah. Because there's no there's no four colors like there's no there's there is five volt and there is ground and but there's no data receive and send negative and positive receive and send so I'm just gonna assume that this is just for power and not data now you know what time it is it is soldering time. Use this. Sorry, I always has to be used on an adult supervision. If you're 21 plus, then you can use it. Adult unless you are trained. This is for educational purpose only. Keep that in mind. So you know, I'm not responsible if you do anything of this kind of 
you know level because it's it takes years of understanding Mm-hmm. Never consume the order of this. The when it creates the order, the fumes. So, wow, that was really simple. <laughs> So it's done. Right now, we're going to just going to test the uh, continuity. Continuity meaning if there's a clear flow of signal from one end of the keyboard to another. If in, if we'll call it simple English. So this is a multimeter. So let's see if it's going to read if if it's going to beep a sound from both the ends, then it's perfect. Now, for example. we have blues and we have we check blues one is done what there's a oh the ends are open right oh, yeah makes sense this is going to this that is why What is here? Where is the other end of this cable? Oh my goodness! Here, yeah, so it could be it from any one of these nodes. No, nope. simple. See, when I say continuity, mean like this. Oh, so now continuity. That's here. See the sound. Okay. So blue, blue. No sound. I see. White, white. No sound. I see. Nothing, eh? Okay. No problem. So my computer is now going to work. Connecting directly to DC. Sorry. Will actually get the work done. So now, where is my camera? Let's go back. I'll just be right back. So, I am back. Now, what I have here is a soldered connection. You can see this soldered, soldered, clearly, properly soldered, each and every component. Now, what I need to do is test it. And see if it works or not. Say hi to my friend. So now this is the iPad. So don't forget to subscribe and share your love because I got to fix this iPad, which is cracked. It dropped horribly. So don't forget to subscribe and comment below that. What do you think? Is this iPad repairable or not? Pretty sure. So okay, fine. Never mind. So now the main thing is, is I'm gonna cut, gonna cut it this end to the power. That is, wow. Okay, now it's the moment of truth. Generally, what happens is if I connect this, a light should show up over here. It showed up. It it actually worked. <laughs> It's a success because 
Come on, man. There's no loss in DIY if you know there's a possibility of it going to work. And it's official. Congratulations. It's working. See the indicator. Oh my god. This is awesome. This is amazing. So that's all for today. So don't forget to subscribe, like and comment below. Honestly, what do you think of this video? This is, I don't know, something off the hook. Like I've never tried this out. That too first time soldering an ethernet to this. So I'm like, look at this. It shows it works. Like it works. So yeah. Anyways, to the next video. Take care, stay safe and peace.